there is a serious political shift. ANC and DA dominance amid EFF's declining influence causes a stir on the socials already in South Africa in the political sphere. Since the election results were announced, the political landscape has been dominated by the ANC and the DA, with a minor presence from the MK party. The latter party has been contesting the election outcome, claiming that they secured a majority to take over the government based on their own vote tally and alleging election fraud. This has kept them in the spotlight but their influence is waning, especially after the president announced the new cabinet. Following this announcement, the MK party criticized the ANC for choosing to collaborate with the DA instead of them. However, the opportunity is passed and they have to accept their status as the official opposition. Even the EFF has been overshadowed by the government of national unity, almost to the point of non-existence. There is a certain tweet that had this to say. CIC Julius Malema will be the president of South Africa. He's not even desperate for that, but it is going to happen. Don't ask me how, just save this tweet. So much is being said online already about everything that is ongoing. Their voices are no longer as prominent as they once were. That is the EFF, of course. Despite this, the EFF Secretary General remains confident that Julius Malema will eventually become the president of South Africa. It is said that Malema is not desperate for the presidency, but it is believed that he will attain it someday. The timeline for this is uncertain, but it is known that he has long aspired to the presidency. Some people argue that if Julius Malema wants to become the president, he should reconsider his stance on illegal immigration. This issue may have contributed to many South Africans not voting for the EFF as the party is perceived to protect immigrants over South African citizens. For Malema to become president, he will need the support of immigrants as well, given the protection they receive from his party. So much has been ongoing already in South Africa, especially as far as who the president should be, who the president shouldn't be, who the leading party should be, what the leading party shouldn't be, and Malema happens to be one of the most controversial figures in South Africa so far. In the comment section, and without necessarily judging, I want you all to give me your honest opinions about what you think and how you feel amidst everything ongoing right now. I love you all. Thank you all for watching this far, and I'll see you all in our subsequent uploads.